Hi everybody, Martin Hazy, Lord Mayor of Adelaide. As usual, it's great to be with you. I'm sharing with you the update from this week's council meeting right here in the City of Adelaide Council Chamber. We decided some very important matters. Firstly, we're signing an MOU with Jaipur, which is a city in the state of Rajasthan in India. Now Jaipur has some 8 million people and that city from their government has a very strong technology focus, in particular a smart city focus. So does the City of Adelaide. So you can immediately see the synergy, whether it's smart traffic management, smart water management, smart energy management or people movement throughout the city, data and smart city tools are very important to both of our cities, so we're signing an MOU to collaborate. Secondly, inclusive play opportunities. Throughout the city of Adelaide, in particular in our wonderful Adelaide parklands, we have a number of play spaces and we now have plans in place to ensure that they are more inclusive for more people those with disabilities included. So I thank in particular the team here at the City of Adelaide. I thank the Access and Inclusion Panel, who's made up of independent experts who provide us with guided advice. Also, I thank Quentin Kenahan, who's been a great champion of this project. Thank you. Thirdly, the Adelaide Parklands Dry Area. Also this week in the City of Adelaide Council Chamber, the members voted to extend the dry area throughout the parklands in the City of Adelaide, which effectively means from 8 p.m to 11am the next day, every day of the week, that there's a dry zone throughout the parklands. This is a complex matter, and the Council has debated this issue with great sensitivity. What it means, though, is that Council and the State Government and a number of service providers are working very closely together to provide better services and better outcomes for those that are most vulnerable. At the same time, we do know that the dry area, which may be a stopgap, is actually improving behavioural issues and outcomes in our parklands. We understand the sensitivity of this matter, but the councillors are very cognisant of ensuring that we find that right balance. Thanks so much.